you're beautiful. I know. Oh. In this one, we get much closer with Shadowheart. I'll let a clown perform surgery on me, and I'll have to fight hard to escape a goblin camp. Hi, I'm Mad Morph, and this is my full playthrough of Baldur's Gate 3. Before we jump in, you can find all of my links at madmorph.com, follow me on Instagram for updates, or have me read you a bedtime story on my free podcast called Down to Sleep. It's on YouTube and everywhere you get podcasts. Now, let's continue with Baldur's Gate 3. There's something I want to talk to you about. Okay. Something important. We need to talk, she said. I can never take for granted how someone might react when they learn I worship Lady Shah. Easier to just keep it a secret than take the risk. But you showed you had an open mind. I did. I'm trying to say that you've earned my trust in a way very few ever have. I want that to mean something. I want you to know more about me, at least from what I can remember. As long as I prayed to Lady Shah, I wished to serve her as a dark justicia. There is scarcely a greater way to fully dedicate yourself to Lady Shah, save perhaps if you become the head of her church. To become a dark justicia is to become the Night Singer's sword arm. Her implement with which she will cast down the unbelievers and win the final battle to restore her perfect, endless darkness. It's all I ever wanted. I prayed it was my calling. But Mother forbid me from seeking to prove myself worthy of the rank. She said I was not ready. Not my mother mother, I should add. Mummy. The Mother Superior. Head of Lady Shah's enclave in Baldur's Gate. Sometimes I wonder if she would ever deem me ready. I owe her everything, and I only wish to serve, yet she can prove inscrutable. Do you think she'll ever relent? I don't understand. Why be so secret about it? Thank you for sharing. Well, that was a load of nothing. I'm not sure why you bothered. <laughs> Do you ever think she'll relent? I don't know. Perhaps if I succeed in my mission and reach Baldur's Gate. Hope has little place amongst Lady Shah's children. Mm, you started to it's be a bit hopeful illusion, there though, didn't you? A distraction. For this, I hope my time will yet come. Well, thank you. Hmm. I can't help but feel you and I might have missed a chance to connect. Truly connect. Well, look at Karlak looking at me like, what are you doing? I think I know what you mean. There's an undeniable rapport, and oh. yet we haven't made time for each other. We haven't. Time alone. Yes. Easily remedied, if you like. Oh? I know a place. Okay. I like that. Lead the way? Not just yet. Oh. Let's choose our moment. Some quiet night, when the others are asleep and there's no distractions. I'll come for you. Will you? Ahem. <clears throat> Alrighty. <laughs> Well, let's go, uh, on that note, let's go massacre a goblin camp, guys. What do you say? Get some of this bloodlust out. Minus the blood. All right. Got some leaders to kill. What up, my gobbos? We're just gonna, uh, go see the leader. Maybe from up that ladder where we can get a good vantage point and... Not worry too much about anything actually might be a good idea, mightn't it? Well, it's now or never, I guess. See ya. Oh. Sorry, um, just stay right there one second. Thank you very much. And see ya. Plenty of You were seen killing someone. <laughs> Best explain yourself before you're added to the body count. Uh perhaps some gold? 
tempting as it is, the guard will not accept a bribe in this case. Oh. Well then. You've chosen death. Missed. Nibble him instead. Actually, wait. Nibble when you need. No, it's a bonus action. Do it. Good. Again. I actually haven't realized over there yet. If I can do this quietly, we might be alright. Excellent. Oh my god, it only did two damage. End the latter to save the former. Jimmy on the go. Hit that frenzy. Ah! Gotta wait. Keep going. Get him, get him, get him. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, Smooth miss. Work. Now they've seen. Calling reinforcements. Okay. Let's get in there. Almost able to kick him off. Rain. Hopefully I'll get the ice on the next one. And what else do we have here? Ah, oh, I wonder if I had the thorns, if I cast it here and pulled them towards me, if they would end up in the hole. That would be pretty neat. Swift as my feet can carry me. Environmental kills. Like this. Three. Ah, she moved out of the water. Oh, she's quite close to the edge there. Might be able to pull this off. Now this is my happy place. Strong barbarian push. Make it happen. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh wait, what about looting her? Oh. Damn. She probably had some nice loot. Oh wait, she dropped her backpack. Oh no, it's just a camp supply pack. Damn it. Guys. <laughs> She probably had some nice weapons. Oh, do you know what? I'm going to do it again because I want the loot. Interesting. The host is dead, but the parasite is still alive. Who's got a scroll? No to go still. For my boy. Take you Heal me, damn you! What to do? Hmm. Parasite, you see. Ah, uh, see, this is... I didn't even think about her having one in there. That's totally worth it that I repeated it, because if I kick her off the edge there... I mean, she got some nice loot, too. But also for the this parasite. This is a true soul parasite. It can enhance you. You can absorb its potential. Open your mind to it. You already know how. Open your mind to the tadpole. Hmm. So it's whether we're doing that or not, but I mean, yes. Embrace your potential. Swells as it subsumes everything the tadpole has to offer. Everything it was and everything it was destined to be. 
Pure potential. Pure power. Good. You have grown your power and improved your chances of survival. Hmm. So now we're, uh... Sucking out powers. So, you've indulged. Just helped yourself to a little more power, I see. And there isn't a tentacle to be seen. <laughs> Not a bad deal, I'd say. My only complaint is that you didn't want to share. <laughs> I wouldn't mind indulging myself. I was going to say, your party would get a bit jealous. Mm, they're mine. Maybe another time? I wasn't sure you'd want to indulge. I admit, I wasn't keen to be the first to try it. Uh, just in case there were any, uh, surprise side effects. <laughs> but now that we know it's safe, I'm all for experimenting. Well, maybe another time. I might just hold you to that. I wonder what it's actually done for me. So now, just the boy on the throne. Then through. Ah, my good fellow. Quite the cosy setup you have here. I'll just make myself comfortable. Thank you so much. Has your research turned anything up that might help? Research turned up a rather brilliant technique that seems quite actionable. It's not too deep. Just behind the orbital socket. I could attempt an extraction. I've a needle in my tunic, after all. Um... This seems like a terrible, terrible idea. Do it. Volo carefully holds one of your eyes open and begins oh, no. to prod uncertainly with the needle. <sighs> oh, Volo, endure the discomfort. The needle finds the gap between eyeball and socket. Volo frowns and begins to push. Don't push. Clench fists. Pain shoots through your body as the needle snags on your optic nerve. Sir. I think I have it. The needle seesaws back and forth, plucking the nerve like a harp string. Oh, bother. There's some obstacle in the way. I shall need a more robust implement. Hold as still as possible. Volo carefully withdraws the needle from your eye, then reaching into his bag. He produces an ice pick. Listen. <laughs> oh, God. I the implement, but allow him to proceed. Volo slowly brings the ice pick closer to your eye. Now. Don't move. Is this going to kill me? Let's find out. Hold your breath. Cold metal presses against the skin beneath your brow. And then, tap, tap, stab. Oh. Do you feel that? Ha! I think we have the blighter on the run. Oh, oh my. <laughs> I agree. It's a feisty critter. Just a little further. Volo tears the pick from your brain with a violent jerk. Your eye plops down into the mud. Yikes. You just took my eye out. I mean, that could look cool. Do I get an eye patch? He pauses, looks down at your eye, and recoils slightly as it sinks into the mud. Like when Thor lost his eye. I thought I was going to die. There appears to be an amount of cosmetic damage. You knocked my bloody eye out. Please, try not to overexert yourself. You're in a rather fragile state at present. I can't help but feel partly responsible. Perhaps there is something more I can do. Partly. <laughs> I 
They get a fake eye. Take this. A far superior relic to that old jelly you were chained to. I'd rather an eye patch, but... Size. And, um, it was very nice to have met you. I'm sure you'll sort out your little brain problem one way or another. Far away from here, if you've a heart. Terribly sorry, my friend. He's gonna run away now. <laughs> See invisibility. What have I got? A bleeding eye. Your eye stings. Disadvantage on perception checks. But that's running out. See invisibility. Can see invisible creatures within nine meters. Creatures must succeed a dexterity saving throw or lose invisibility. Because I've because of my fake eye, I get a buff, a permanent buff. Two permanent buffs I have now because that Loviata's love is staying too. Okay, I mean, I just wanted to see what would happen. I was fully kind of thinking I would end up dead and I would reload the game but that's not a terrible outcome I might I might stick with that I wonder if I look any different I don't seem to I did have very nice eyes is that what is that one I think slightly different but it's not it doesn't look too different to me I'll stick with it I think also it's a cool little story even though it's a bit embarrassing that I let him do that my character probably wouldn't have, but I wanted to explore the option, and it's worked out well for us. Now I have a cool eye. Sort of thing that gives you a bit more interest as a character anyway. Um, right, let's go kill some goblins. What's up? There's something I've been wanting to share with you. If now's a good time. All is. It's difficult to put into words. Oh. I think it might be easier to just show you. Okay. Use the tadpole. The connection. Come into my mind. Sure. I don't remember how it started. Only how it ended. I was fleeing. Flashback. Young Shadow Heart. The Fear of Wolves. She said she has a fear of wolves. before those woods. All I know is she saved my life and gave me a new home with Lady Sharp. Mummy. <laughs> it hurts. That's all I remember. Brainwashed. No wonder you're so dedicated to her. Thank you for sharing that with me. I know it can't have been easy. Normally I'd agree. But with you, it's getting easier by the moment. I know the feeling, babe. Uh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Just, I mean, look, it's an RPG. It's, you got a thirst for all the characters. This is, this is the way it's played. This is the way. Okay, so I had a bit of difficulty with this one. So we're going to try something new. I turned into a cat. I snuck into where they were storing the barrels. And, uh... Yeah. We'll see how this goes instead, I think. In three, two, one. Let 
that's him taken care of at least, and now we just have to clean up the goblins. Let's see. How about some of this? Bye bye. Okay, well, that's embarrassing. Get him a Starian. I'll uh, try myself, shall I? And. Bye bye. Right. Okay. I wouldn't think it would be that hard to shove a goblin. <laughs> These big chunks of combat, at some point, I think I'm going to sit down and really think about what my party is, and I might even respec some of these characters to sort of really balance it out. I really want someone to be a ranger, honestly, since that was huge for me in Divinity. Um... Maybe maybe I should be a ranger. Be a druid. Druid, but with a bow. Right, what are we doing? 14, 14. Well, let me try and stun you. The misses keep coming. The misses keep coming. Oh, I should have raged up. Got a whole room to kill. Let's try that again, shall we? Oh! Astarian, why did you push me? <laughs> I'm so sorry, darling. I was aiming for the goblin, I swear. Let me show you how it's done, babe. I knocked him down there. Did they not die? Oh, that goblin didn't die, but he's being eaten by the spiders, and now this goblin is trying to help him and shooting some spiders. That's scary. Hope we don't, ow. Hope we don't end up down there. This feels like a really good way of doing things. There you go. Some more food for you. They look absolutely gross. Oh, I hate it. Like, actually closing my eyes. <clears throat> Makes me feel weird. Cleave these two. Good job. Good job. Double kill. Let's go. Um, let's go have you deal with this guy over here. Look, since you like helping them so much, fight the spiders. Why don't you join them? You did it. You actually did it. The leader's <coughs> dead. <laughs> Praise Sylvanus. No, that's not right. Praise you, my friend. The Grove owes you a debt beyond measure. Thank you. Killing's never my first choice. Well. But those three were too dangerous to leave alive. Thank me not. The slaughter was a pleasure. Hmm. I've done my part. Now tell me about Moonrise. Let's get out of this pit firstly. Return to the Grove. I'll make my own way there. I can see to some matters there, and we can discuss what comes next amidst more bucolic surroundings than here. Meow. Oh my god, he turned into a rat and ran away. That's amazing. Well done, gang. I think we've earned a long rest, but you know what? Let's not do it in here. Let's actually treat ourselves to a night in the woods. I'm hoping the goblins outside don't Seems know that enough. we've massacred absolutely everyone in here. And it won't automatically trigger a bunch of fighting, but we'll see. Hello, little rat. Well, as it turns out, the goblins are all attacking me. And if I go outside, there is a bunch more goblins. So we're going to actually do our long rest inside. And set up camp in this hallway before we charge out and take on... Another troop. 
because we're all pretty close to death. How much farther can I go? Anything happening in camp? Doesn't seem to be. No one wants to have a conversation, so we'll just go to bed. I'd be back. Don't worry. I have things under control. For now. You haven't been using the parasite's power. You think you don't need it. But things haven't gone as you expected. You hoped a druid as powerful as Holton might be able to remove your tadpole. But he couldn't. You're desperate to be rid of it. Understandable. But you're looking for solutions in the wrong places. I don't care about the tadpole. I've been offered a greater power by my butler. I kind of want to say that just to see what he says. Ambition is good. You are resourceful and will gather many allies butler. to aid your strength. Use them how you will. But whatever you do, a word of advice. Do not listen to that false butler. Oh. He knows nothing of what the tadpole is capable of. Your parasite is unusual. It is wrapped in magic that prevents its removal. Until the source of the tadpole's magic is destroyed, any attempt to remove it will kill you. Okay. You were lucky that Holson knew this. His instincts are right. The parasites were merely a symptom of a greater sickness in Faerun. What is the sickness? The absolute aims are not yet clear to me. But its progress towards domination is clear. These parasites are more than illithid spawn. It's like body snatchers. They are vessels for control. The infected hear the voice of the absolute. And believe it to be a god. You witnessed it yourself with Priestess Gut. That is how the cult of the Absolute is spreading. The highest of their rank, the True Souls, carry a tadpole just like yours. It is how they receive their orders. It is what makes them obey. When the order to transform is given, it will not be a matter of days. They will be mind flayers in an instant. Were it not for my protection, so would you. Hmm. And who are you? It's complicated, but I'm an adventurer. Just like you. Just like you, I was infected with a mind flayer parasite. Just like you. I seek to be free of it. I've been trying to escape from this evil for a long time. Once, I almost succeeded. Now, through you, I've been given a new chance. You can go where I cannot, and I can protect you from that evil. If we work together... How are you protecting me, though? turn this around. Because I feel like the device with Shadow Heart is... Hells. They need me. I have to go. What is going on over there? The power I used to protect you. I stole it from someone. They want it back. I will hold them off for as long as I can. But sooner or later, I will be worn down. You must discover the source of the magic that controls the parasites before that happens. The cultists are gathering at Moonrise Towers. Use the powers your parasite gives you to convince them you are one of them. And when you find the source of their magic, destroy it. Go. Our freedom depends on it. I wonder what everyone else's guardians look like. So, we all had another weird dream, did we? Something's on my mind. 
I had another visit from that dream figure. Mm -hmm. I take it you did too. It claims that if we infiltrate the heart of the cult that's giving out these parasites, your ears are really distracting. We'll find story, the yeah. answers we're looking for. It gave me another gift too, just like it did the first time it appeared. Rather generous, if you ask me. What gift? I didn't get a gift. Hmm. To infiltrate the cult, we must be discreet. And if that fails, then there's always killing them quietly. Now, was there anything else? Yeah, what gift did you get? Um, so about you biting me? I've already apologized. What more do you want? Unless you're looking for another nibble. Maybe later? <laughs> I need to know how we'll feed you in the future. I'd be like, mm, maybe later. Maybe. But there won't be any more midnight surprises. I can promise you that. What is it, Gail? My condition is worsening again. <sighs> I need to consume some powerful magic really? or it may become volatile. You're an addict. I'll give you... What's this do? Adrenaline rush. Once per turn when you dash, you gain wrath for two turns. But they're rare. I just got those. Gloves of power. On a melee hit, possibly inflict a d4 penalty to the target's attack rolls and saving throws. Sleight of hand plus one. Or a locket with dancing lights. Um... I guess I'll give you the gloves of power. Thank you. Get that down, ya. Yeah. Have a suck on that. Sucks all the magic out. It is a strange experience. Each time anew, I kind of lost soul is spelunking through the darkness that is me only to be sacrificed on the dread altar of the heart i like but the word spelunk this doesn't feel quite right i mean it never feels right but it relieves this doesn't relieve oh. mm. don't tell me you need more tell me you didn't just waste a piece of magical equipment gail what's happening the magic isn't having the effect it should have. It's not like the last time. Like a rainstorm that quells a forest fire. It merely drizzles. The embers still sizzle. The fire remains undefeated. I'm not certain what's going on, but nothing good. Please, I need to think. I need to retrace my steps to a glade of calm and think. Thank you for the artifact. A great deal of trouble it was, too. A great deal of trouble, indeed. Quite like Gale. Wouldn't mind a wizard in the party. We'll see. Karlak isn't quite growing on me as much as I thought she would. She's, like, disapproving of all of my sort of naughty ways, you know? It seems <sighs> to be the perfect night to spend a little time together. Yes. Just you and I. Assuming you haven't changed your mind, of course. Mm, let me think. Lead the way. Oh my god, we're having a little waterfall drink. You made it. Come here. Sit with me. What do you have in mind besides the bottle? I wouldn't dream of missing it. Drain the cup in one swallow. Listen, I think Shadowheart's got a little bit of class. Let's, uh... I wouldn't dream of missing it. So eager. I'm surprised it took you this long. Well, to begin, I think a toast is in order. Any suggestions? To victory. To survival. To us. To friendship. Do you know what? I love that we're just like a couple of half-elves as well chilling here. I think she's half-elf as well. Starion's high elf. I think she's half elf. We're half elf. 
We look so good together. To us. Bold. What does us entail? I suppose I'll find out. To us. Yo, what a cute spot for a little nighttime day. Now tell me something about yourself. And no tadpoles, dragons, marauding goblins, or anything like that. Something about you. Hmm. Surprised you cared. Share a little memory from growing up in Baldur's Gate. Other things we could do besides talk. You first. Persuasion. Um. It's tempting to persuade to get even more Shadowheart lore. But she has shared quite a lot of with us, you know? So I think it's time to reciprocate and share a memory. Seems like you truly know the city. I never got to explore it to my liking. Don't stop now. Not just as things are getting interesting. She's like, when I was a child, there was a bakery that I loved to go and get croissants in the morning. What's a croissant? the worst backstory ever. She's like, oh god, this conversation got really dry. Sorry, just necks the wine and leaves. Listen, your turn. I insist. A little give and take's only fair. Come on. Are you kidding? No. Inspiration that. Sorry, not happening. Plus the two. Thank God for being charismatic. Don't laugh, but I'm not quite sure I have anything to share. Oh yeah, you don't have a memory. Sorry, when babe. Worship shard. Secrecy is everything. Me. We'll sacrifice <laughs> our own memories when ordered to. A lot of the little things. Now lost to me right now. Whoops. Do you think your memories will ever come back? Dude, what if her memories come back and she's like, Oh, I'm married. Well, will they ever come back? Perhaps. But please, enough about me. Sharing's bad for my complexion. There's still plenty of wine. Please, you look good with a little blush. So cute. And she knows I love waterfalls, you know? She brought us here. Come on, first date vibes. Nearly light. The others will be awake soon. At least snuggle. Look into her eyes. The others can wait. I don't want this to end. We should go back. Look into her eyes. Hello. What? You're beautiful. I know. Oh. But you're sweet to notice. <laughs> Thank you for last night. Okay. Surprising, but I kinda kinda dig that. Ah, oh, hope there'll be more to come. Me too. She trails off. You read an invitation in her eyes. Oh. So I can kiss her, or I can say, if you want something, you should take it and let her kiss me. I mean, kiss her. She's laying there thinking about how beautiful she is. She needs to be kissed. She doesn't want to be told to kiss you. That looks like such an awkward position to be kissing from. Look how she's like, hot. sit up, guys. Or get on top, something. That didn't hurt, did it? Sorry, just critiquing a beautiful moment here for us. The pain was worth it. I should think so. Let's head back. If we must. That was cute. That was very cute. I wonder if you romance with others, if it causes any issues. I guess we'll find out. Wakes up to find a starion feeding on me in the night. All's well, I hope. Of course, unless something's the matter. I wanted to talk to you about the night we spent together. 
I do want to talk about it, but I'm worried that'll be an option that's like, oh, we should never do it again. So let me just save in case. I was going to say the very same thing as soon as I worked up my courage a little. Well, I'm feeling I brave. I can't recall the last time I shared so much with someone. Maybe I never did before. It meant a lot to me. You mean a lot to me. Oh. And that was before the kiss. It's so cute. The fact that you can say, it was a mistake, forget it ever happened. Right after she said that to you? No, it meant a lot to me. I hope there's more to come. I hope so too. Though I'm not sure what kind of courtship will be afforded, given all that we're facing. But if you want to see where this goes, I do as well. Hmm. You and I, we share something special. I want to talk about it. Very serious of you. But go ahead. Admit it, you've never had a relationship quite like this one, have you? Even if I could remember, I'm not sure I'd tell you. <laughs> I don't want your ego to get overinflated. Come on, we can both be egotistical. I said you're beautiful and you said, I know. You're pulling a Han Solo on me with the I love yous and come on. I want to get to know you more. You already know my biggest secrets. What more can you ask? Hmm. Well, tell me something about yourself besides Shah, besides Sadpols. Again, she doesn't remember, but... What? Besides my life's calling and the greatest problem I've ever faced? Oh. Well, I like night orchids and can't swim. Is that the sort of thing you meant? Alright, babe. Someone woke up on the wrong side of the sleeping bag. Jeez. You'll have to point out night orchids to me if we have a pass one. It's a deal. Well, anything else? No. I can't. Quite literally, I mean. With my memory suppressed, I can't betray Shah's secrets. But I can't remember much of myself, either. If I manage to return to Baldur's Gate and fulfill Shah's mission, then my memories will be restored. You've had your memories suppressed. Seems extreme. Of course. It is an act of faith, not to be undertaken lightly. Shah will reward me when I succeed. Hmm. What do you make of these illithid powers? Because I haven't used them yet. What do you think? On one hand, they seem useful. But on the other hand, or perhaps tentacle before long, we know where they're coming from. And what lies at the end of that path. Mm-hmm. I never expected Ceramorphosis to be tempting. I think we should resist these powers. There's simply too many unknowns for us to risk it. Hmm, perhaps you're right. It's been known to happen. Why am I into this sass and this ego, man? What is wrong with me? Like... Can't slow down. Never gonna have a peaceful life, am I? That's the I've way. got a long road ahead. <laughs> You're just like, oh god. You know when you just, you have a thing and it's like, causes you nothing but trouble. Jeez. Everyone knows. Everyone, is, everyone who's ever had the I can fix him, I can fix her vibe. It's like, yeah. Respect that out of yourself, to be honest. Um, what I'm thinking is maybe we can escape through the Underdark. Oh, there's illithid powers up there. I hadn't even noticed that. Three of them. Do the others have them too? Fight never quiet. Moving in. Let's see. Let's see. What? Okay. My character is me, apparently, saying exactly the same things that I'm saying. If we escape through the outpost. Wondering if how do we Soldier Someone with ranged No loot. Can we like attack this? 
Do I have to get forward a little bit more? Oh! Ah! Careful. Okay, that does zero. Well. Hmm. Ungroup. Hide. I could just try and sneak by, but I'm wondering if I can take this out. Or this. How do we stop it? Wait, there's a, an explosive barrel up there. Maybe that's an idea. I'm nothing. Okay, stop hiding, darling. If you insist. Yeah, there's quite a few explosive barrels here, so I'm guessing that is the way to make it through. Shimmy this over there. Oh, I hope this is in the right place. I don't know where else I could put it. Give it a go. There's others. Oh, that's oil. Thought it was going to blow up. Oil. Oil. Is this kind of the font of its power or something? Or this? Ah, Moonstone. Hang on. Shadowheart is inspired. He likes that. Destroy Salune's protection over the Undark Fort. <gasps> Sweet guys. What to do? Group her back up. Time to press ahead. To the Underdark. Is this actually a way out? I don't know. Just trying to get back to the grove here. These fungal spores are everywhere. Gods! What's happening? Is this place collapsing? More are coming. That voice. What was that? They're coming. They're coming. Um. Still your mind to this unusual voice. Careful. If we can hear it, perhaps it can hear us. They're coming. You're coming. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, sir. Listen. What the Whoa! The hell? That wasn't a bullet, was it? Some creature down here. Have a lot on my mind. Ah. Oh. And well, in it. From goblins to eighty-four health minotaurs, like please. I just want to go home. Oh my god. This is not going to end well for us, is it? Not falling for that one, is he? Still on my feet. get over the what would be ice yep oh my gosh right lovely okay that's just wonderful isn't it at least you're all busy for a second nothing important is ever 
Honestly, what I need to do is have one with water and another character shoots the ice. So it can get done in one. What does that do? One to six. Great. I heard everyone else. Yourself. Take you. Not on you. Oh my god. Why can you even cast that on them? This is gonna feel good. Do you have Eater Shove? Makes sense. At least it's ice under them. Swing and a miss. Always waking up. Nice. Two opportunity of attack. Still 50 health. This is mental. This is insane. Crit for 20. 30 left on that one. Maybe there's a chance. Poison. Try being a raven. I can blind them. Might be helpful. Saved from the concussion. So much damage. It's you. Take you. So if I can blind them, they should be able to do too much damage, right? Hopefully they'll miss me. Leave them both. Okay. Oh my god, if we actually win this fight... Who's already blinded you? Blind this one. Miss. Sixteen health. that one. Good. Alright, they're both blinded. Gonna need you to get back to damage. Heal. This is kind of all you, Karlak, so... Free health. Oh my god, you're the last one up. Oh dear. Oh dear. A clear 
cleave would be so nice right now. Did the Starion just die? Jesus. Finish this one, please. At 35%. One down. Stay alive. I just... Nope. Shadowheart just died. Come on. Five health. Throw an acid vial at them. Oh, it's on both of us. Twelve. Job. Help me up. Karlak, help me up. Damn, it's good, to be alive. <sighs> good fight. Actually, one. The other At two are dead, but we can interesting. get them back. An amulet. <laughs> How a Starion died. So dramatic, darling. Need to find a way forward. So, can I go to my camp and get Withers to bring them back? I think. Is that a thing? I wonder if our camp's going to be here in the... Oh, yeah! It's all mushroomy! That's so cool! That's awesome. Look at this place. I love that it does that. Thy wheel of fate turns ever to the dark. Dost thou require a new ally? Or mayhaps a resurrection instead? Resurrections, please. Then thou must return with the proper payment. 400? Good lord. This is the price of balance. Is the gold. Well counted. I recommend keeping my distance for a moment. What do you mean? By doom and dusk I strike thy name from the archives. Rise. Why do they rise? Oh, right here. Starion? Well, hello. What can I do for you? Um, a thank you would be nice. had another dream which i suppose means you did as well we did all have Whoever's a dream whoever's reaching out to us truly does seem opposed to the absolute but wants us to embrace the tadpole venture right into the heart of the cult perhaps we truly have a secret protector or we're walking into a trap I think my eye is slightly different, but it's very similar to the eye that I already had, because I had pink and blue already in my eyes, you know? Oh my god, I had I got one health. Nice little nap. There you go. Leave camp. I don't want to end the day, I want to leave camp wanted to resurrect them. That's pricey. But then those resurrection scrolls are pretty pricey too. Hoi. Well, good job everyone. Killed some Minotaurs. Minotaur. Let's see if this doesn't lead out somewhere. What's hiding here? Man only wants to go home, you hear me? Oh! And it burnt away the thing. I climbed it just in time. 
and you okay let's get going group them up these Let's see what's in them anything oh hello what's that all sorts Just like a mine. The Zenterim. Mercenaries and cutthroats. Useful friends if you can afford them. Where? What are you What are you looking at? Oh, is that what that symbol means? Right, okay. So there are mercenaries and cutthroats, like an outpost here. Oh my god, so many gems and rings and stuff. We're rich. Fruit. Alcohol. Can we uh, pick this lock? Sorry. Oh, for a skeleton key. Oh my god. Wait, why is that a critical success? I thought that was a zero. Arrow of Roaring Thunder, Arrow of Darkness. It's not even that good. Why is that locked in there? Now, do I want to go down in the lift, or do we want to explore the rest here? Let's see what else there is here first. One day I'll catch a break. Looking to go down, trying to go up. Doesn't seem like that's <laughs> the direction we're going in. Torches. Well, we can cast light, so. Sure, why do we have all of those? Just loot everything, as you do. What's down? There's tents down there. You know, I don't think this is the way back to the grove going to be honest with you. Not sure it's a way out. But we're here now. Doesn't work. Oh. What am I doing then? Can I go off the edge here? Maybe I'm attaching that rope that was here to this or something. Let's see. Rope, 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 rope. Where did you go? Just picked you up. Literally right now. Rope. Oh, hang on. Can I use you somehow? Throw. No. Doesn't look like that. Oh. Maybe it's back the way we came. Oh, we can scooch down this way. I don't even know what this place is. Timas, known to cause confusion. Right. Let's not get too close. Well, a little bit late on that one, babe. Broken oh. bones. Must have fallen. <laughs> We're shroomed up. Might, might. Succeeded a nature check. New recipe. Wait, this is where I thought the minotaurs. So, this way. Let's go back around. And down. Nightlight frond. I mean, this is a lot of effort to avoid some goblins at the gates, isn't it? What's that? A sword? <gasps> Excalibur? Save it in case it's something insane. Slender drow blade impales the stone before you, keeping a silent vigil. 
religion. This feels holy. Consider what the appropriate ritual might be. Ah, religion check. Not very religious. Well, that's not going to do it. Damn. You can't recall anything this esoteric. There are too many rituals about swords to count. Do I get another go? Strength check. Grab with both hands and pull. It's not going to go much better for us. Nope. Critical failure. No matter how you grip or tug, the sword remains firmly lodged in the stone. <laughs> well, someone else want to go? I'm guessing I don't get to Slender try again. Blade. Impale. Let's try someone else. Carlac, -like, you're strong. On it. Slender drow blade okay. impales the stone before you. Give it. A give it all you got, babe. Oh my God. A four? No matter how you grip or tug, the sword remains firmly lodged in the stone. Who's going to get it? We'll go one by one. We'll see if anyone can get it out. Try a religion roll. <gasps> oh, but the minus one. No, failure again. You can't recall anything this esoteric. All right. Shadow heart. No time to waste. You're probably a bit religious, right? Slender drow blade impales the stone before you. Get up keeping there. Keeping a silent vigil. Religion proficiency plus two. Yes. Let's see. Hit me with it. This blade was a warrior's sacrifice to Elistray. Blood can only be honored with blood. Blood. A blood ritual. The drow script inscribed on the blade flickers and glows. It rises from the stone, hanging in the air in silent offering. She's inspired by that. How fitting that it was her who got it then. Item received. Nice. Can you use this? A long sword instead of a mace. Maybe we can have it. That's I like that. I like that for you. We'll give it a go. A lot of Despite inspiration everything. happening for her in this area. Mind my step. All right. I was really hoping to make it back to the grove, and that would kind of I've be the end of the episode. I don't know how long this one's going to end up being. Wait, I'm back here. That's not where I want to be. I just fell off the cliff. I'm dead. Well, well, well. And I don't have any resurrection things. Bloody hell. It's really starting to feel like this is not the way out. <laughs> and I should probably just go fight through those goblins. Oh, look at that waterfall. Wow. Um, because... It's, yeah, it's just feeling like we're getting deeper and deeper and it's not a way out. I thought it would be a sneaky way out. Maybe there's a different way out, but I feel like Let's get going. this feels later on. Um, so I'm going to turn back. Right. 
What is this? Can I... Getcha? Damn it. Maybe we're just positioning? I feel silly that I wasted a spell now. Help Astarian up. I also really want to go back to camp so I can respec everyone. Oh. Oh. What is that? A bullet. Predator of the d Predator of the Dark. 125 health. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. So I can't make it laugh. Can I make it sleep? Too many hit points. What do I do here? You've got a lot of health. Okay, well, I mean, it's one enemy with all of us focused on it, even though we're already pretty beaten up now. Let's just give it a go. Ugh, I wonder what that tastes like. Starion. Time to push my luck again. I'm nearly dead, so I'm gonna heal and then see what happens. Um, hang on, can I cast heal and then turn? I can't remember. Or should I just turn straight into a bear? I think it's actually more important I heal Karlak. Regardless. Why did you move like that? Okay, so I can't wild shape after that, but... Maybe... Oh, I wonder if I had Animal Friend, I wonder if I could um, prevent you from attacking if I had prepared that spell. I'm going to... Put spikes under you, so if you stay there, at least I'll be doing a little bit. Can't give up. Not now. Over time. You're all out of your spell slot, so you can't actually heal. What's this? The sword hums in anticipation, ready to burst into maddening shrieks or bolstering song. The sword has its own power that we pulled out? What is that? No mercy. <laughs> Oh, wait, I'm supposed to select a variant. Oh. What? What the hell? Hang on. What was that? The sword shrieks. All enemies within six meters have penalties to charisma, wisdom, and intelligence saving throws. Afflicted creatures receive an extra one to four thunder damage. The sword stops shrieking if unequipped. Dude, it makes... <laughs> this one is a singing one. The singing sword in Roger Rabbit. The sword sings a melody. All allies receive a bonus to attack rolls and charisma. What? Not enough resources. I mean, do it on the next turn if you're still alive. We might need to... Oh, wait, just step in. Oh, my God. Okay, sorry. I was trying to spread us out a little so we didn't have kind of a crazy moment, but... That's what happens, I guess. Can you even be poisoned? No resistances, okay. Can I help her up? Frenzy up. And then, I guess, chill. Take a potion. Someone's got to take a trip to the shops because we're burning through potions. Starion, it's you. Let's turn someone inside out. Okay. It's a little bit. I'm hiding for you. What are you gonna do? Deadly leap. Oh, getting on the spikes. Just puking up all over us. Damn. 
Damn, Astarian, how are you missing? Alright. Is there any spells I want to do? No, bear it up. So many wild shapes. Bar. Now that's a fight. Let them fight. It's kaiju style now. Uh, do I get you up? I feel like you're just going to go straight back down again, so maybe I need to do some damage. At least get the lacerate off. Make them bleed. It's going to be good over time. <laughs> I could throw you at them. No? I wonder if I can throw, like, an exploding mushroom or something. I probably could if I was near one. laugh at me? Are you running? You're running. It laughed and then ran away. Don't burn yourself. Whoa. Can't give up now. Guys, I think we should get out of here. Never a dull moment. I think we should go back to the grove. Oh. This is, what is that? A petrified drow. This place is beyond us, I think. Best be on my way. That's, oh, an oil barrel. You could set that up and there's a trap. Let's go back because I really want to, um, what's this crate do? Just another crate. Oh, okay. <laughs> I want to respec people and get spells that I'm a bit more comfy with. I'm going to try and sort of recreate my divinity too crew, I think. Um, I played through that with Losa as like a blood witch, so. I don't know if I can do that in here, but we'll see. Oh, 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 oh. An elemental wizard might be fun too. I'm staying druid though. I can just keep my main character and I'll change other people. All right, so trying to fight my way out of this goblin camp. There is a bunch of them on the other side of this door, which is proving to be a problem. So what I've done is gone and respect into kind of what I want to be. I've been playing for a while now. I think we're like 16 hours or so in, but I want to have my party feel like it's the party that I want. So I'm staying as druid, but I've respect some of my spells. Astarian is now a wizard because I really miss having just a full spellcaster, and I'm not really one for stealth and rogues, and I wasn't really doing too much with him. I tried, but um, it wasn't as effective as I wanted it to be, so I'm going to try him out being a wizard of conjuration with a bunch of spells. Shadowheart is staying as a cleric, but I've made her a cleric of life, was like a different subclass, so she's like pure healing and support role. Going to take care of us all, hopefully, and give us resistances and do a little bit of damage too. Come on, let's go! And Karlak's going to be our barbarian as she was before, Berserker. Um, and just taking some time to go through people's armor and their weapons and make sure they're kind of kitted out for now. I haven't really like bought any weapons or spent anything, but a bit of a rejig. So this is going to be like our no, first test yet. of this new crew. Just because I was kind of struggling with the combat. So I've tried to make it feel a bit more like it did when I was playing Divinity. Um minus a ranger, although a Starion's going to also have a crossbow. We'll see how it goes. He may end up being super weak. So, let us begin. Oh, and also a Starion wears these boots, which electrify any puddle he's in, which is cool. If I bless us, whilst we're all standing here, might be a good way to start this battle with a bless. Um, for everyone, right? Oh, yeah. There you go. Blessings upon you, and conjure myself a spiritual weapon. My own little bit of defense right next to me. Oh, wait, I've got to click it here. I can have a spear, a maul, a great sword, or a great axe, or a trident. What would you conjure up by your side? 
trident sounds fun. Get him a little spear. And I guess I'll try and keep you busy and take you on. Running away. Went around the electrified pool there. I didn't accidentally cast that weapon for the ogre, did I? I thought I was casting it against him. They're also blessing. All right, Karlak. Let's... Do we go for the ogre? Or do we go down there and start swinging? I think you just go and wade through the mob here, babe. Frenzy. Go and spank him. Oh! Missed that boy right there, didn't I? Critical miss. Fair enough. Nothing important is ever easy. Alright, it's me. I'm the problem, it's me. Say hello to a growth of spikes at your feet. Thank you very much. I'm going to come here. I have plans for you. And shillelagh it up. Actually, drop a little heal on Karlak, because she already took a bit of a smack there. There we go. Alright, Astarian. I think if you move, you're going to get... He's going to try and knock you, right? Now, what if we extend the water pool? So if this guy's going to be here, like, okay, and around him. Get shocked, you know? Get shocked, fam. And I'd really like to kind of be up here and away from you, I think. Oh! I can also get electrocuted? I'm sorry, what? Am I, do my boots not have rubber soles? I am electrocuted also by the water I step in. Hang on a second. Electrify water. When the war when the wearer stands in water during combat, it becomes electrified. Water sparks. If the wearer starts their turn on electrified surface, they gain three lightning charges. Right, but why don't I have a resistance to electric? So I'm going to be doing that. Seems mental. Oh, I control the trident. Do I? You can fly. Not enough resources to fly. Ooh, spectral weapon. Stay there and stab them up if they come near us. Dude, got enough archers out here. Enjoy my thorns. Where'd that arrow come from? Someone took out a little personal vendetta there, I think. Nothing to do with me. already feels like it's going much better. We got some synergy now with us. I should have done this way sooner, but I was just so excited to play through the story and carry it on that I 
didn't really take the time to sit with it. I mean, Divinity 2, when I was playing that, I sat for hours going through the spells and kind of seeing how I wanted to. And I'm sure it won't be the first, last time I do it, I should say. Um, can you throw a heal my way? Thanks, babe. And you can just see what we have here. If we hit a guiding bolt on Big Boy, do a bit of damage, and then the next one for an advantage. Just move back slightly, but stick with Astarion to defend him. Oof. That's big damage. Show yourself. I was looking for my invisible druid. Sense hidden presence. Saved. Couldn't find her. Blast for 16. Starion. Okay, those electric boots might not be the way to go. Let's be honest. Right. You. Let's just swing. Actually, if I pick you up and throw you at the ogre, takes care of you and knocks them down, and then I'm going to move in here whilst they're prone. I won't give in. Try and deal with that. My plan here with them is that we keep them in the thorns. Like, they come... To, I'm going to cast thorns behind people. They come to me, and then I'm going to... Send them back into the thorns. They have to continually move through the thorns to get to me. Is my plan with this build. Drop a heal. A little bit of healing from my druid as well. Just to use it as this big, like, AoE control. Previously, I used blood and fire to do that in their other games, so... Being stabbed up. Okay, it's you. Let's get a starion up. Hello? Oh wait, that's my spectral weapon, sorry. Get stabbed. Thought it was Shadow Heart. Man. Probably shouldn't turn to my back on them. Up you get chum. Do 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 do. Healing. I would like to stay alive, please. Take you, you. Wakey, wakey. Guard Gurgan. Sounds like Swedish. Guard Gurgan. Well, it's just no point resing people unless you've got a big heal to go awesome potions. Let's be real. all healing each other from the thorns. It's an issue. 14 health. I think I just drop it under them again because it does so much damage. It's going to be pretty useful. Oh! Karlax down. Don't want that to happen. Level 2. Take care of Get her up. Let's go 
long time. Just can't do anything. Have a potion. That's about it. Still a tough fight, honestly. Not sure how other people have handled this. If you played this game and you've done the wiping out the goblin camp, how did this go for you? Because I'm finding it quite tough to fight through and also to fight out of even once the deed is done. I'm probably missing something. <laughs> could, could be. Let's be honest. Ah, oh, miss with the spectral weapon. Bummer. Shadow Heart. Can you get rid of this boy? The one. Miss. Hush. Right, healing then. It's just the two of us, so let's make it count. Oh, he killed my spectral weapon. Alright, it's you. Let's try a cleave. Do we still have cleave? Backbreaker. Oh, maybe I don't because I've changed weapons. I don't have cleave anymore. In which case, possibly not. Oh man, Cleve would be so nice here right now too. Some sort of AOE. I think we need to get rid of this boy. Honestly. Maybe if I throw another one of you at him, that's a way to, like, double up here. Target's too close, threatened. So I've got a disadvantage on trying to pick you up. Didn't quite do it, though. Now what's happened to my bar here? Um, getting beaten by a bunch of drunk goblins. It's annoying. Hit. 94%. Do I need to do more than a main hand? Until your next turn, you have advantage on attack rolls, but enemies have advantage against you. I don't want that. Alright, that's one. And a frenzied strike on another one. I'm trying to clear him out. Oof. Miss. Miss. There's more up there. Are you kidding me? I mean, this is, this is tough. It's tough and it's rough. Folk a healing energy that restores your allies. Will this get them up? Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. My sweet, beautiful cleric. Okay. Hit the nines, let's clear them out. Good job. Gotta get you some more healing potions. Ah, what are you doing? I was trying to click that guy. I think he's actually dead. He's just standing there alive for some reason. That's fine. Okay. 
spare time. Or maybe this thing. Thirty hit points. This thing has twenty-three, but it's got a charge. Although I do kind of want to goad as well. There it is. Always bear. But I can't hit yet. Starion sitting this one out. Stay in it, Shadowheart. Use the singing sword. Oh, but I can't hit with it. I just cast the singing, right. This guy's got quite a bit of life. Let's um, knock him back. Miss. Too close and threatened for me to pick him up. Come on, cast the idol. Get rid of this guy. Also, go. Hang on. Hopefully save Carlax some from some damage here. Never mind. Two elf. Oh my! Oh, they just cast a walk companion out of the floor. <laughs> Potions. Gosh, darn it. Oh, I need healing. Damn. Boy. Excuse you. Hey, you guys calm down over there. Get over there. Please stop missing, Karlak. Please. an ivy, baby. It's even more up there sleeping. Two sleeping, which actually have quite um, a lot of HP compared to the others with seven. Still breathing. Come on, mate, what are you doing? Well, that did not go well. One HP. Ugh, this fight is really hard. With pleasure. 
You managed to do it. I realized as well you can just fast travel if you want to, but it felt disingenuous to fast travel out of here and not just try and fight through and get it going, you know? A dwarf's poem. A son of Saloon fell here in the dark below. We sealed his grave in her holy glow. May the full moon never touch the stars once more. May darkness never conquer the moon maiden's door. It's, um, a clue. To that floor puzzle again, I think. So there are another couple. There's up here. If you, I can't quite look high enough, but there are still goblins alive. To get the fast travel there, we may just go kill those ones quickly. Can you dispel those thorns? Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. How do you do that? On my way. Because uh, your spikes are still here for a hundred turns. How do I tell them to go away? Would be nice, wouldn't it? This was the chicken running area, wasn't it? Seemed to be anything else there. Okay, let's get these loots. Or any more. Just the loot hiding among the spikes there. Anything of use? But like as a druid, I should be able to walk on these without pain. Oh, some good armor there too. Oh, there they go. They disappeared finally. Is that a flute and a drum? Oh my gosh. Was it a flute or just a bone? I wonder what I was supposed to do with this goblin's drawing. It must have been somewhere here, right? A hand drum. I can play the drum. Guys, just a little vic victory song celebrating, you know? Come on, don't be shy. We killed the goblins, we squished them good. We are the baddest in the hood. Here we go, here we go. Goblin killers, way and ho. Do, 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 do. No? Okay, sorry, I'm just trying to have some fun, guys. It's taken us hours to get out of here, but alright. You don't want to celebrate. You don't want to celebrate. That's fine. Maybe a flute? Let's give it another go. can't sing and play the flute at the same time. Not interested. Alright, I mean, just, you know. Cultural. A liar! Oh my god, these sound amazing. The power. Come on, Astarian. Come on, Shadowheart. This is attractive, right? I'm gonna buy a liar. I'm gonna learn how to play it. It's happening. Alright, fine, you spoil sports. Let's go back to the grove. Jeez. Save it, because I really don't want to do that fight again. Ever. Okay, there's these ones up here by the gate too, huh? The big old wargs and guards. Ah! Oh. Spotted. Okay. Let's go ahead and throw some grease in the gate. Oh. Oh. <laughs> uh, there was some explosives there, huh? With that grease. The guy that was up that tower that spotted us just got absolutely demolished. 
Well. Be quick. Nothing will stand in my way. And then I'm thinking, oh, I can't cast the spikes anymore. I don't have any more level two casting. Okay. It's just Time to press ahead. Then. Maybe I can cast animal friendship on the. Huh? I never went and spoke to these. They're just sitting there drinking. Probably fun. You miss so much things. In the, like You have to do multiple playthroughs to see everything in these games, honestly. Good. You lead the charge. Spiritual weapon really helped me out in that last fight, so throw that amongst them as well. And a fireball. Wonderful. Okay. Dun dun dun. fighting a goblin war. They're trying to nibble my trident. Um, that's my range. What else do we have? From how far away can I do animal friendship? Oh, pretty far, actually. Ah, oh, must be a beast. Doesn't count. I might just throw this spike and then... Might create a little bit of ice, too. Hopefully. Good job. Light on my feet. No. Ready for round. Haunted Trident. Moving. So many misses with the crossbow, honestly. Three scorching rays. Good job. This way. Gonna call some reinforcements. Bang your drum, they're all dead, my friend. Merc your whole crew. Actually, feeling kind of powerful now that I've changed a bunch of spells and stuff around. This is gonna feel good. Happy with it. Combat feels so much better. Incoming. Now we kill that drummer boy. Now we kill that band. You know that film, we can be friends. Ah, uh, 
That did interrupt this lot drinking, though, and called this group over. Yes, take your turn. Come on, darling. Thank you. Well, what do you say we uh, apply a little grease? Enjoy slipping around in that. Slit. Oh, my little goblin sparrow. My goblin coccyx. Oh, I landed right on my gobby tail barrow. Hmm. Entangled. Okay. Can I set fire to the grease? That's my question. I mean, that is awesome, isn't it? Oh my god. That's so fun. They're gonna die before they come over here, honestly. I'm gonna fly out here and deal with these. There we go, that's one. for this one. Five. Flip over the barbarian's back. Sorry about that, Karlak. Mm, the smell of burnt goblin. Magical darts here. Well, you've still got quite a bit of life, actually. Hmm. Maybe. Let's try chromatic orb. I haven't done that yet. I want something that could maybe get both of them. It's magic missiles, then. Two on you, one on you. Tormented. And then go in here to get some backup. Oh, forgot there was still one there slipped in the grease. Clawed and chomped. Imagine of all of these targets trying to hit the bird out of the air. What's wrong with you? Over there. I mean, imagine seeing Karlak just charging towards you with a warhammer, raging like that. No thanks. Anything you can throw nearby? Finish him. Nice little firebolt that she has. And chat. Oh, there's a guy right there in the bush I didn't see. Throw some acid in the bush. So he likes that. No choice but to keep going. Miss. Critical miss for you, though. Disengaged as well to get away from me. There is no running. Tactical. For you. Let's end this. Let's make this quick. 
miss. Oof. Um. Feel that anguish. Nice shot. Never a dull moment. Broke his armor. Now this is my happy place. Should have had you run in there with the warhammer. Let's be honest. Come on, Show us Much better. Good job, everyone. Always well fought. Could have. GG baby. Let's get on with it. So where is your prayer of excuse you prayer of healing heals all allies you can see, but I have no level two spell slots to cast it. Nice little nap. It's a little short rest. And now. Grimy chest for you defending. It's alcohol. What about this one? No traps, please. Bunch of potions. The butcher calls. No, what are you? I thought I had cancelled that. I'm sorry. It's like, Jesus, you're gonna be dead. Oh, there you go. Well. Delicious. The druid buffoon. Let's travel back to the grove. Open up. Can't give up now. Time to see what's happened. Why are you all hanging out here? Scouts just reported. The goblins' leadership has been decimated. We might escape this place yet. I took a collection from all of us. It isn't much, but you've earned it. Thank you. It's not enough, but it's all we have. Hal Sin will likely want to thank you too, mind. He returned just a while ago. I believe he's catching up with Corker. As for us... No armies at our heels. Amazing. We can finally leave. But perhaps we need not speak of farewells. <gasps> we'll join your camp tonight to celebrate if you'll have us. We're gonna party? Yes, we'll see you there. What? Awesome. Still. I'll kiss you when you stop bleeding, you lummocks. I'm your lummocks. Yes, you are. Adorable. Thank you for watching. I hope you're enjoying this series. I'm loving playing this game. Please do hit like and subscribe if you haven't already. And check out one of those videos on the screen. I'll see you in the next one.